Hello and welcome to this Paint Tools I advanced tutorial video where I'm going to show you how, uh, how to make straight lines and how to colorize the content of a layer. Um, I already made some Paint Tools I tutorials. Um, if you haven't watched them, I suggest you do so because many of the beginner techniques are described there. But let's get started. So, those straight lines, how to make them. Well, you can either choose to use your pen tool or your brush tool, doesn't matter. Um, just press down a point, you see I press down a point here, and then hold down shift, and it'll make a straight line to wherever you, you make your pointer, and then press again. So, this is very useful if you want to draw s yeah, anything with straight lines, but also if you, if you need guidelines uh, for drawing something in perspective, like uh, for example here and you would want these and these. So now it becomes much easier for me to do something with depth. Um, so for example if I if I want to draw something just loosely and like this Yeah, it's not the prettiest of boxes, <laughs> um, but it's yeah, it's actually just to show you how uh, how this can be useful. Um, so this is how to do straight lines. Remember, after you made a line, you can of course rotate it by pressing Control T, and then just rotate the line uh, to fit your needs. <coughs> so. One of the things I typically do is I, I make a sketch of whatever and my problem is that often I forget that hey I'm drawing with black and then I cannot use my uh, hue saturation here. Uh, it doesn't matter whether I turn this or this. I can, I can manipulate my luminance but it's not like in Photoshop there is no colorize option here so I cannot colorize the layer uh, afterwards. But um, I can of course lower the opacity and then draw on top of it. But if I want it to be red, the easiest thing to do would be to control click this layer, create a new layer, uh, choose my red color and then choose my bucket fill and then just press. Uh, then I can mute my black layer. So now I have a red layer and now I can easily change the color. So if I want my guidelines to be blue, this is now possible. And now on top of it, I can make a finer, finer layer like this. So I hope you found this helpful and um, that those are some techniques that you can use for making your own awesome art. Please, uh, yeah, link in the comments below if you if you uh, found this helpful and made some nice art yourself. And bye.